Hey there folks, welcome back for another shaving video and today we're going to use Sterling Arcadia and uh, this is a beautiful soap or at least the scent is beautiful, I haven't used it yet but you know Sterling quality is always great so I don't uh, feel there will be any problems with it. This is 5.8 ounces, the price is $13.50 which is about $2.33 an ounce which is excellent. I mean that is phenomenal and you get a great container great waterproof label probably more than 5.8 ounces ah, wonderful scent on this by the way scent strength about seven seven and a half so good good scent strength um arcadia reminds me of son of zeus if you're familiar with razor rock son of zeus very very similar to that scent it's modeled uh, after a clone or inspired by i should say beautiful beautiful scent arcadia so Let's uh, get going with Arcadia. We will use the Sterling Kong brush here and we'll see how we do today. And this should be, uh, this should be outstanding. <laughs> the quality of Sterling is phenomenal. Uh, I had one guy comment on one video said it was, you know, that I was full of it, that Sterling soap was terrible in quality. Come on, come on, please. He's probably one of those guys that likes everything high end and it's in his head that those are better. <laughs> Cause believe me, I've tried them and by and large they are not. The quality of this runs with anything, high end or not. And I think, I think I've mentioned this before, but uh, I was talking to the inspector last night and what tends to happen when you spend a lot of money on a product is you want to justify that purchase. It's just natural. So a lot of times um, you will rationalize or come up with reasons why it's the greatest ever and it very well may not be. It's natural. I've done it. I fell in love with super high-end products in the past, but then I come down to earth um, when I actually use it over time and compare it to pro products like this and I go, you know what? There ain't a hell of a lot of difference. <laughs> so why am I spending... 60 70 80 dollars for a soap <clears throat> when i can get one for 1350 that's phenomenal like this performs right there with any other soap out there in my opinion anyway great stuff here good load let's wet the face and get going stay tuned all right it is friday morning and i'm thankful for that it's been a long week at work but i can tell you the shave is going to set the day off or start the day in the, in the in the way I like which is positive which is great and this smells wonderful by the way very very much like Son of Zeus by Razor Rock that scent profile it's not a dead ringer they they do have different interpretations there but um in terms of the way they you know are inspired by that scent but both very very good in fact I'm using the Razor Rock um, Son of Zeus aftershave today and I gotta tell you one thing about Sterling you can probably see it here creamy creamy great lather a trademark not a trademark but it's definitely a uh, something Sterling is known for look at that just great stuff. Smooth it out a little bit and we will get to, get to work today with our, um, cut that down a little bit, Aristocrat, uh, sent of course by the great Don the Navy Goat, I think last year. Wonderful razor here and the soap doesn't get much better. I don't care what anybody says. Um, for me, phenomenal and um, actually for most people the only problem they ever had with it was the side odor and now that that's gone this is great wonderful I'm a big fan as you well know now because I'm not in favor of wasting money because I've wasted enough <laughs> and boy I think the straw that finally broke the camel's back 
on wasting money with me was that uh, Panagrama Nueva or however you say it. It was great. Don't get me wrong. But I saw in all the forums, you know, this is the greatest soap of all time. Nothing is ever better. Bah, 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 bah. I bought it. $80, a little over $80, what it cost to get it from Italy to me here. And I got it and I was like, this is really, really good. But it's not $80 good. Nowhere close to it. In fact, maybe it was better than this. Maybe not, but only marginally. And I paid $13.50 for this. Come on. I mean, I saw the fawning over it. The scent wasn't spectacular. It was very nice. I mean, it was, let's put it this way. If it were $20, $25 soap, be fair. People even fawned over the container. It's just ceramic container. I mean, it's not particularly elegant, in my opinion. And I was just like, you know, after I used it, and I used it a couple of times off camera, and I'm like, $80? No, sir. Not none whatsoever. Stay tuned. So, then I checked it against my Martin DeCondre and my Saponificio Veracino and other subs that are a little more expensive, and they're all about the same, you know. I think Panna Kramer probably has the edge on uh, Poe Shave over, like, Martin DeCondre, but... Or Dick Andrews not worth $60 either, in my opinion. So, because when I use these soaps, back to back with those soaps, other than the scent, you know, Martin DeCandre Fougere is one of my favorite scents of all time. But other than that scent, it just doesn't have that much going for it. Now, it is triple milled and it will last a long time. So, you get some good value out of Martin DeCandre, I think, for that reason, because it takes very little product. So, you do get a little more mileage out of it, I think. I gotta tell you guys, after having been through Aqua de Parma, x -Bec, Martin de Gand, all these expensive soap. Come to the conclusion that you can just stick with a $20 under soap and at least for me, you're not getting that much. It is just not, you know, the law of dimin diminishing returns really comes into play when you're talking about soaps with that kind of cost. So, so that um, Panacrama really was the straw that broke the camel's back because it led me to start investigating my other uh, higher price soaps and I'm like, you know what? I'm wasting my doggone money. You'll notice I say I'm wasting my money, not yours, because you may feel strongly that it's the greatest soap of all time and it does something for your skin and, and that's okay. But for me, it was just not a wise purchase and I got rid of it. I didn't even keep it. I got rid of it, re recouped a little of my money and bought some more like this. <laughs> so anyway, um, this stuff here is phenomenal. And that's my true feelings because I tell you what, there's not a doggone thing in it for me. You can ask uh, the vendors who are in my top five and top ten lists. Ask them. Hey, do you all bog him down with a lot of free stuff in exchange for his opinion? They'll tell you. Hell no. He buys it. <laughs> anyway. This is outstanding. And it's going to be a great day. Friday, hurricane blowing through down in Florida. Boy, prayers, thoughts and prayers with those people. Whew. Stay tuned for past three. So yeah, you folks, if you're on the, if you're down in Florida, even a good ways inland, Georgia, South Carolina, North Carolina, be careful. I hope if you were in a direct path, you evacuated. And if you haven't, I hope you stay safe. Cause that's a monster. When that water comes in, it's devastating. Boy, this is great stuff. Great scent. I didn't even know um, 
when I read the notes for this on Sterling, I didn't know it smelled like Son of Zeus. And so I was really pleasantly surprised. I was like, yes, because I like that scent a lot. And both Razor Rock and Sterling do it very well. So hats off to those folks. All right. Looks like we got a good lather here to finish up our final pass. Wonderful. What a great way to start today. Of course, you guys will be watching this, you know, in the afternoon or evening or over the weekend. That's okay, but I hope your day, by the time you have watched this, because I post in the afternoon, I hope your day went well and your weekend gets uh, kicked off in stellar fashion. I'm feeling good today. Of course, you know, Unless I'm not feeling well physically, I'm feeling good every doggone day. So, there is that. <laughs> and the shave gets us all in the proper um, mindset, or at least it gets me in the proper mindset. Because by the time I'm finished here with my shave, and I get my witch haze on, my aftershave, the face feels fantastic. And that's where I really enjoy... Um, this style shave and then throughout the day you'll feel your face and it just feels phenomenal and it's great. Just great. And I know other people do that too. Some people call that face gerbation, <laughs> rubbing their face. But, um, you know, you're proud of your shave because you used to have shaves that absolutely suck. I did too, believe me. And so, And you discover this style and you're getting some really phenomenal shades. I mean, you got to feel your face. All right. So fantastic, fantastic. Three passes there. Let's uh, wet the face, get our post on. Stay tuned. All right. So phenomenal shave. Let's uh, add the magic to the mix. Magic is made by witches. Dave's. Ray Pope says Humphreys is just as good. I don't know. I never used Humphreys, but theirs has never let me down. It does everything I needed to do, so I stick with theirs, you know. Um, it served me well. All right, what else are we going to do? We're going to do our aftershave. And like I said before, Razor Oxana Zeus sent matches the Arcadia. It's beautiful stuff. By the way, one of the things that I do, or when I rem remember to do it is, I pour the aftershave out of the back, like so, a few drops, um, so the alcohol doesn't run down the label because I have had, or aftershave I should say, um, aftershaves before where they don't use a waterproof type label or and if the aftershave runs down it'll ruin the label and to some of you that doesn't matter uh, yeah and I just wiped off the <laughs> aftershave off the top sitting around the cap but uh, to some of you that doesn't matter but if you care about it just pour it out of the back and you know wipe it off if it runs down the bottle a little bit aftershave is wonderful actually everything is wonderful sterling Kong was outstanding then we have our uh, aristocrat Sent to me by Don the Navy Goat. Thank you, Don. Very much appreciate that. Great shave with it today. The Sterling Arcadia, phenomenal. As good as any soap out there for $2.33 an ounce. Wow. And of course, finally, our Son of Zeus by Razor Rock. You guys have a great Friday. Thanks for watching. Until next time, let's make America shave again.